researchers at FAU's Harbor Branch are getting a rare opportunity to get a close-up look at the coral reefs miles offshore and hundreds of feet deep. For three days, research teams have been scanning the ocean floor and subs to determine if fishermen in our area are damaging the reef by bottom fishing or trolling. News Channel 5's Megan McRoberts rode along with researchers today and has more on what they found deep beneath the surface. Almost 10 miles offshore, researchers with FAU's Harbor Branch take in a rare opportunity take it back. to squeeze into submarines, trying to find the Oculina Reef hundreds of feet below. It's home to hundreds of species of sea life attractive to fishermen. These are the reefs that provide habitat for those fish. And so if we lose the reefs, we lose that resource of fish that we derive a lot of our economy, tourism. Researchers looking to map the reef and see if it's been damaged from trawling. Nets and chains dragging on the seafloor to collect fish. When researchers inside these submarines, along with divers, make it to the seafloor about 300 feet below us, it'll be the first time anyone's explored the Oculina Reef off the coast of the St. Lucie Inlet in more than 20 years. Divers join the submarines to collect and examine the coral they find. Today, finding rubble from the Oculina Reef, indicating damage. Looking for nets, line, etc., is important as well. All of this is made possible by an organization called Project Baseline, a group working to document seafloor conditions in nearly 60 countries to help track changes over time. Our, our one of our goals or one of our objectives is to help organizations like Harbor Branch accomplish their goals. Researchers hoping their efforts could help support proposals to make Oculina reefs off our shoreline protected and help fishermen preserve this vital part of the environment. Megan McRoberts, WPTV News Channel 5.